Breaking news. APC leader Bola Tinubu 2023 presidential manifesto leaked. Hello, my wonderful people. You may not understand it. Most of those people, it's not because the want to lead comes from the heart. It's genuine and it's true and it's something that they want. You know, they, they have it as an inborn thing, something burning in them that they want to administer administration to help better the life of people and make Nigeria a better place. No, that's not the quest and that's not the desire. Sadly, it's a well-written script. Again, this was what happened in 2015. And before you could say Jack Robinson, we were all swayed out. When they came with exorbitant, you know, position to say, well, we're doing this, we're doing that. At the end of the day, where are we today? Buhari promised a lot. But what's happening with all the promises? Please do not forget to give us a thumbs up, like us, share, subscribe. Thank you. APC leader Ashwajo Ahmed Bola Tinubu presidential manifesto leaked. Why speculations about Ashiwaju Ahmed Bola Chinubu interest in the 2023 presidential election has been raging for months. The leak of the former Lagos State Governor Manifesto has put to rest any doubt about whether the All Progressive Congress shifting will run for the country's top job. According to Leak Ninja, Tinubu got a leaked manifesto over the weekend, indicating that it is just a matter of time before he declares his candidacy for the presidency. The manifesto titled Seven Point Agenda, the Rebirth Manifesto, outlined Tinubu's vision for Nigeria if he were elected president. Education, technology, infrastructure, Domestic enterprise, leadership, true federalism, democratic process were about the seven essential items included in the campaign masterpiece. Leadership, provide transformational leadership that has the ability to unify all of Nigeria and lead us to the attainment of the shared goal and vision. Technology, leverage modern technology for digital transformation and economic growth. All this will not be like English. Let's continue. Create conditions that allow citizens move and transit freely across the nation. Infrastructure, commence extensive infrastructural development by building basic fundamental services, 24 hours access to electricity road bridges that connect power people business ultimately providing quality of life businesses build platform that enable and empower homegrown businesses to scale and complete favorable global market education deploy initiative targeted at promoting knowledge and equipping learning of all age group with the skill and value needed to address modern day challenges globally, propagate and, de propagate and actively strategize and put on strategy that will also promote a sense of pride and awakening among all Nigerian citizens to the extent that people feel extensively patriotic in Nigeria. True federalism and democratic process promote democratic re realize human potential and create conditions for prosperity and progress. Source disclosed to lead Nigeria that Tinubu, a former Lagos state governor, would declare his presidential ambition officially in the new year. Sources disclosed that he was just waiting for the convention of APC to be over. Our leader Tinubu will declare interest in in the presidency very soon. We are confident that this man will take Nigeria forward, he has said. Tinubu has remained silent about his interest in the role despite rumor and speculations. Several organizations, including the Southwest Agenda for Ashiwaju, have insist have instead taken it upon themselves to rally support for Tinubu's candidacy. Tinubu's latest move, which include a visit to Kano State earlier this year, have given his presidential ambition even more legitimacy.
According to observers, the visit was designed to robust connection with the northern with the north ahead of the election. Ozi Kalu, a former governor of Abia State, recently paid Tinubu a visit, sparking rumor that his bid was to succeed Buhari, despite the allures of presidential authority and the influence of Nigerian political environment, particularly his role in President Muhammad Buhari's ascension in 2015. Many experts say that the former active Act, the Action Congress leader should be a king maker rather than a king. So that is Tinubu. They said he should be a king maker, remain a king maker. King makers never become king, you see. They remain king makers. They determine. They, I mean, if you've watched A uh, King of Boys Part 2, I think he puts a bit of light, okay, to it. I mean, what's her name? She finished the movie. She's a very good actress, I must tell you. I was thoroughly impressed. I mean, I was thoroughly fascinated by, you know, her role she played. But what am I trying to say? We're trying to explain that, indeed, it is actually, you know, a, a true position where we have a government that understands the people, not someone whose has been, script has been written for. Okay, one who has whose script has been written for is not consigned about the people. Okay, is not consigned about the people. What is consigned ab about is how he can, you know, get those things for himself. It's about my achievement. Okay, it's about me, you know, and that's what it is. And that's what it is. With some of these people, they don't care about what's happening to Nigerians. No, that's not the point of call. The real point of call for them is uh, the next political stand, uh, the next thing I need to do, how I need to do it, and all that and all that. Not because they care for people or not because they, they see a need, you know, they see a need and they feel it is essential, it is important that these needs are met so that, you know, life can be better and people can move forward. That's not the drive. That's not what it is. For them, it's a different ball game entirely. And Nigerians need to wake up to the realization that we are with the people who do not really, you know, will I say understand or do not want to understand what is going on with individuals or what is going on with Nigerians. Now, a well-written script has been scripted out. Is he connected? Is he is it related? Is this script a true reflection, a mirror image of his heart for the nation? Or just a well-written script that people will want to hear? These are things we should be thinking about. Leave us a comment. Do not forget to like or share, subscribe. God bless you. Have a fantastic and a lovely day. Remember, you have a voice. We decide. Bye for now. Bye.